I'm struggling. I'm coming to you real and I can't do nothing. I can't change it by myself. Now watch this. Why did worship get him? Because he came to do the will of his father. Watch this. He commands us to praise if we got breath. But worship is voluntary. In John chapter number four, he says, the father is seeking. He's seeking those who will worship him in spirit and in truth. She got past her flesh and she cried out from the spirit. When you're going to overthrow your flesh, quit being mad because they rejected you. And let it go. And say, here my Lord. You've ushered me in for such a time as this. This opposition in my home has become an opportunity for you to reveal yourself to me. For you to flash me with your glory. For you to show me that you're still with me even though I'm on the outside. That you're pulling me in. Y'all not hearing me. His heart changed because he was there to do the will of his father. And his father wanted worshipers. Can I preach like I feel? Why would God won't worship us because he lost one third of those who worshiped him. The scripture says in Isaiah around the throne, the angels said, holy, 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 holy is the Lord God of Christ. Is there anybody in here ready to take off everything? Yes. And say, Lord, hear my. Yes. I'm tired of faking it and keeping it quiet and, and making everybody think that I'm deep and everything is all right in my house. Lord, I'm hurting and I'm struggling and I'm about to lose my mind. I'm challenged on every hand. Yes. And if you don't do something, Lord, I'm going to lose it. Yes. He come, mama, 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 Somebody came here because you've been smiling on the outside, but you've been crying on the inside. And God said behind all of the makeup and the fancy hairdos and all of the fancy garments, I see your heart. And I sent you here tonight because you can't take too much more. Thank you, Lord. Keep me in that same, same, don't, don't come out of that. Please flow with me. Thank you, Lord. 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 The devil fought you every night. But he let you get here. But tonight you're here. And God said, because you broke through. Yes, Jesus. I'm gonna break you out. Come here, baby. There's a change. Don't look strange. There's a change that God got for you. Hold your hands up. Close your eyes. Don't look at me. I'll have anything for you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. There are a lot of things you suffered and went without. But I heard God say this is the season of change for you. Get ready to embrace the new and right now. You're not going to have to wait. God said you paid the price for what I'm getting ready to do for you by what you went through, by what you experienced when folk forsook you and thought you wouldn't make it. Thank you, Lord. Hey, I am It's been hard the last year. But God said, this is the season of your release. Thank you, Lord. God said, I'm releasing you to live. I'm getting ready to bless your life like never before. Oh God, I feel the power of God. Lord, in the name of Jesus, there it is. Yeah, thank you, Jesus. Ah, ah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. It ain't all 
always got to cast the devil out. See the devil in everybody. If you got too many devils, we, we need to really go crazy in the Holy Ghost. Come here, young man. Hold your hands up. Thank you, Lord. Hold your hands up, son. Thank you, man. I know this is a little different for you, but you need a touch. There's some things you need to change that you need to change like yesterday. You were invited here, not by man, it was the Holy Spirit ministering to somebody. And God said the things that you have faced, I'm getting ready to turn some personal things around. There's some things you will still equal. Some pains on the inside of equal. Thank you, Lord. Mm. 